We've had some below average temperatures to start off the month of April, but overall in the month of March, we were actually above normal for temperatures across southeast Minnesota, northeast Iowa. Let's look back at March. Our average temperature was 38 degrees, which means we were about uh, 5.5 to 6 degrees above average uh, for just the average daily temperature. Snowfall, we were above the norm there as well. We had 8.9 inches of snowfall. We set a daily record, I believe March 15th of 7.9 inches. That's where we picked up over 90% of the 8.9 inches of snowfall was the 7.9 that we had in the middle of March. We were just 0.2 inches over the monthly average there. Now we move to April. Today, April 1st, the average high temperature for April 1st is 49 degrees. We're below that, but we'll see a nice little trend here towards April 30th, the final day of the month. We have a nice little 15 degree increase there the time we wrap up the month of April. Another nice thing here, the sun sets later and later. Our sunset tonight will be right around 737, but by April 30th, we'll see that sunset after 8 o'clock. I actually have our first sunset after 8 p.m. coming up on April 21st. So not too bad there. We'll be gaining some, some some sunlight there towards the evening hours. Our weather headlines here. We have a pretty nice forecast on the way for the upcoming weekend. We're chilly tonight. Winds also increase this evening, so we're dealing with some calm winds outside today. Tomorrow, not the case, but we'll deal with some warm temperatures on the way specifically for the weekend and then next week. Warm temperatures continue, but we'll see the chance for maybe some spring showers on the way. Some isolated showers and thunderstorms next week. Outside currently some calm conditions and temperatures are fairly comfortable because of the calm winds. 42 outside right now in Rochester. Our temperatures remaining in those mid to lower 40s. We haven't warmed up a ton today, but tomorrow with those southerly winds, things will change a little bit. Our wind speeds right now at about th uh, calm to upwards of three miles per hour. We're dealing with winds mainly less than 10 outside currently, but as we move towards tomorrow, those winds pick right back up by tomorrow afternoon. We'll have sustained winds 20 to even 30 miles per hour. We could have some gusts tomorrow upwards of 30 to 35 miles per hour. Friday's our windiest day as we move through the next uh, several days. This weekend, not as bad. We'll have sustained winds at about 10 miles per hour with some gusts reaching upwards of 15 to 20. So not as windy as we have been specifically last weekend. This weekend will be pretty decent outside with high pressure controlling our weather right now. High pressure continues to then slide off to the south and southeast. That will allow a southerly flow for tomorrow. Watch the temperatures. We're into the mid to upper 50s. Wouldn't be surprised if we have some isolated 60s on the board for tomorrow. Then we fast forward towards Saturday. Temperatures as we start things off Saturday morning at about 48 degrees. We warm all the way up into the upper 60s and even lower 70s will be possible coming up on Saturday. Your town forecast for the rest of the night. We drop down lower 30s and upper 20s in southeast Minnesota and most of northeast Iowa will be right around about 28, 29 degrees. Forecast then for tomorrow calls for a high right around about 56 in Rochester. We'll see temperatures closing in on that 60 degree mark in some areas, even possible in northeast Iowa. As we take a look at that seven day forecast then for Easter weekend, 69 on Saturday, 72 on Sunday. And those 70s roll right into the beginning of next week. Tom. All right, thank you.